hello guys in today's lesson I am gonna show you how to generate a simple CRUD application in Symfony first thing first let's create our database I'll name it simple blog from encoding I will select UTF-8 click add now I have my database added let's configure it in Symfony Let's go to your application, expand app, then go to config, parameters.yamf, everything looks ok here, just change our database name which is simple blog, that's it, close it, let's go to terminal let's see if it works if nothing is broken php app console yep everything is working let's generate an entity write php app console generate doctrine entity sorry i had some spelling mistake Entity. Yep. So I will keep this entity in my blog bundle. And the name of the entity will be post. I will choose annotation format for it. Let's keep adding fields, title, text, description. that's it guys we only need those field let's press enter to exit this wizard we don't want to generate a quality class okay let's go and check if our entity was generated let's go to our blog bundle see entity folder we have a post entity there let's name it posts We have all our fields created here along with getter and setters. Let's generate our thread now. Go back to terminal. Write PHP app insert. Now we will have to give it entity name. In our case, it is post, which is inside blog bundle. So, blog bundle post. We want to generate right actions. Yes. We want to keep it annotation. Route will be post. Okay. Generate. There you have it, guys. We have our thread generated we go to controller pc posts controller having all required actions for thread like edit add delete and create if you go to for form it also has form for our fields in our entity if you go to resources it also generated all views for our post class for our thread edit index new and show before we go and test the application we need to update our schema let's fire up the terminal write 
php app console doctrine schema date force there you have it guys our schema has been generated let's test it let's refresh it see we have our table successfully created in database let's go back to browser before we do that let's check our routes php app console debug router it will have all of our routes so we can go to posts let's go press enter we don't have anything there but if you write post it will load up our created thread 